We'll just out at a spot marked in the chart as the Oberon Bank. So we'll stop off here, see if there's anything doing. Uh, see if we can get some mackerel or something like that to start with. So, just treat myself to a new pack of feathers, right? Halfway between the mainland and the island of Egg. And, uh, you see our the Markham Lighthouse away down to the south of us. Bait kind of sorted. A wee bit of a surprise. Just uh, picked up a wee wrasse here on the just in plain feathers. But, uh, yeah, we we'll get them unhooked and popped back, I think. So, that's another pretty wee fish. Looks like a wee cruise vessel coming in. Probably like to visit the seals you can hear in the background. Well, we're in reasonably deep water here, about 70 feet. Uh, and it's quite slow moving, there's not much tide here. So, I'm just going to rig up a wee mackerel belly, fish it off a spinning rod, and then have some. Uh, Baited feathers or a bottom rig just to see what else it might be down there. So this is this is us just at Rum now. You can see it in the background there. A lot of cliffs and then there's low-lying rocks just, just offshore a wee bit and then it just seems to drop down to about this 60, 70, 80 feet.
more or less bollock that one. Just under the boat. Very dark. Uh, pretty, but quite small. Maybe a couple of pounds. This is just up the north end of Rom. Didn't know this wreck was here. This little bay in here is just gorgeous. Uh, must have been a hell of a lonely place to live though. You're right up the north end of, or north east end of Rome. Even if I had many neighbours up here. This is the sit up for tonight. I was originally going to stay in the tent, but it was just a little bit too much of an undertow on the beach there. So I'll just stick it out in the boat. So this is how it's set up. All the gear shifted to one side and uh, just a plastic sheet, plastic bivy bag really with the uh, mat on top and then sleeping bag on top uh, should be dry tonight so I'm not going to bother putting on the cover partly because I left it in the car anyway but uh, it should be okay tonight and get away nice and early tomorrow morning but the boat's set up like this deliberately so that there's space to to sleep on it. Don't do it very often but it's handy when you need to. Uh, just standing watching this, it's a fabulous evening. That's the black cooling over there. And then tomorrow I'm heading over that direction. Loch Kurusk. And then back down Elgol, Elgol and then Point of Slate. And then back to where I started at Glen Uig. Ah, it's just before sunrise just now. And that's the, the moon still up over the beach. So, there's some mist creeping up the coast, so I'm gonna, get it, I'm gonna put a wee coffee on and then grab a roll or something to eat. Then head out and do a wee bit of fishing.
just having a coffee and a bacon roll to start with. Wake me up properly. That's the sun just about to come up. It's, uh, it's just after six o'clock. Beautiful flat calm morning. Uh, so there's a wee bank between here and sky. I think I might give that a wee shot. Um, and then head over to Loch Karusk. And after that, just trundle on down towards Elgol and then Aird, across to Arasig. Um, work back to Glen Ewig from there. You can see I'm just in the slightly deeper bit of the bay here. I think it's one of the reasons you don't get too many yachts in here. It's quite a quite a narrow access. Let's see if we can sneak out again. Uh, just got a simple two hook rig here, very basic. It's a smaller hook up the top with a just a smaller bit of mackerel on it. Um, and then a slightly larger chunk in the bottom. It's definitely some rocks in the reef down there, so I'll see if there's any laying or anything like that around. That's the thing with these e exploratory sessions, it you never quite know. Friendly visitor. Hungry, you know. Eh? Not terribly big, but we'll see what it is. And it's a ling. No great surprise. It's just a wee thing. Right, we can go back. Hopefully. Getting ambushed by mackerel halfway down, I think. The place is absolutely full of them.
feels like another ling. And it is. Same sort of size. Let's get him on hook. Got ourselves an octopus now. Let's see if we can a few little bites, but uh not really hooked. Let's see if we can get him out of the way and put back. Right. Go. a wee bay called Dallaville, a few miles north of Point of Slate. I had it in mind for a, a camp and fish, but you can see the seals are kind of beating me to it. So uh, maybe another time. Uh, so we just head down to Point of Slate from here, um, try a wee bit of fishing around the bay and uh, the rocks around there, and then head over towards Arasig, I think. So, uh, <coughs> But we rig down for flatties. It's not ideal rig, but uh, just very thin strips of mackerel. If there's any dabs down there, I'll have a go for them. Just a three hook Paternoster rig with smallish hooks on them. Uh, I don't have any worm bait with me. If there's dabs around, mackerel strip usually gets some around here. Anyway, give that a try in a minute. Well, down at a place called Camas Darak now, uh, just at the point of slate. So the sort of southern tip of sky. Um, so I'm going to drop anchor here for an hour or so. Sandy bottom, about 60 feet. Uh, so I got one set of gear out for dabs and another one out for rays, just in the off chance. And then uh, after that, going to head round the corner here, try a wee bit for Pollock. Um, and then early afternoon, just head across back to the mainland. Just drop these guys straight down. See if we can detect any bites a bit better. Now, some fresh bait going down, so I don't think it'll make any difference at all. There's lots of wee things. So, hopefully, you can see the, the boom there on the lead. All I'm doing is feeding the shrimps and the crabs. Just a little pollock. Just lost a much nicer one. Lost a nicer one, it just went straight into the weed. Just a tiddler.
bugger. Oh well, that's when they got off. Gonna hit the way back now. There's loads of them around. Much smaller thing this, but they work easy. Fish. There's plenty of fish in here, but they're fairly small. That's the cool fish. Hooked. 